Hello YouTubers! What I have here is a portable small 4 inch black and white TV with a FM and AM radio. This uh, little portable system was bought by my dad in I believe in the 1970s and uh, it is still going strong. Uh, I got it because he didn't use it anymore and uh, it just uh, stood and took place in the um, in the garage but uh, as I said it is still working and it is very nice uh, although you can't use it um, straight ahead because uh, in Sweden we don't have the an analog TV system anymore which means that you need a satellite disk and a receiver to convert the digital signal to analog so that you can use um, so you, that you can watch it on the TV and that is definitely working on this one too except uh, the main idea with this was that it was going to be portable and you should be able to have it in your car and uh, bring it on vacation and stuff like that um, let's take a look at the, the front panel as you can, I will maybe do like something like this. Does that work? Yeah, we can have it like that. Um, this is the tuning window for the uh, TV. And uh, you are tuning it on this knob. Here is uh, the tuning window for the uh, radio with a similar knob. Um, a little eye up here that indicates how strong the radio signal is, not the TV signal. Um, and oh, uh, a volume button, uh, power switch, uh, or yeah, power switch. This is uh, the little button that you choose the function right now it is set to FM radio uh, but you can choose also AM radio the TV band UHF and two different kinds of VHF I don't know the difference between th this but I believe uh, uh, since it says uh, H and L maybe it is high and low but I have no idea what that uh, actually means uh, here is the, as I said, the 4 inch black and white picture tube screen. Very nice quality coming out of that one. Uh, here is a uh, earphone jack. And on the back is some buttons for the picture quality settings. Uh, power input, uh, 220 volts and power input 12 volts here is a door for the battery room that is completely rusty since my uh, battery is leaked unfortunately but that doesn't matter uh, here is uh, antenna jack which you can plug in as I said your receiver from your satellite disk or uh, your VHS player and um, if you have a VHS player you can, as I said, plug that in and uh, then plug anything you want like uh, Xbox 360 or uh, Wii or whatever you want into your uh, uh, VHS player and then use it as a, um, as a kind of a converter to convert the signal into this um, interface and then you can use this TV for everything but uh, it is very goofy and as I said, the main idea with this television uh, set when it was made was that it was going to be portable. But um, yeah, as I said, it still works and uh, we, I will show you in a minute how it works and how the picture quality and sound quality is when I've just hooked it up to the... Uh, yeah, hooked it up to a power supply. Be right back. Yes. Now it is plugged into the uh, power supply and I've also plugged in my VHS player and hooked it up to the, the TV and uh, yeah, 
Now I'm gonna take this VHS cassette with Mr. Bean and the Swedish TV show called Malmwagen to and put it into the VHS player and then see if we can find the signal on the TV. I press play and uh, let's see. There we have it. Um, it is of course all in Swedish, but uh, I guess you can hear the and hear the sound quality and see the picture. Yes, that's enough of the TV, I guess. Um, now let's see how the the radio works. Just switch to the radio and uh, press power switch again and uh, as you can see there is nothing uh, currently set on the on the FM band so and therefore this lamp uh, is uh, not so very bright but let's tune it a little bit oh that's the horrible uh, cover on Viva La Vida. Let's switch channel. Allt från Charlie Norman hyllningar på jazzmuseet i Strömsholm, teatrar, krogar upp till jättelika fotbollsarenor ute då. Ehm, i lördags var vi Royal Albert Hall igen och, och så vidare. Så att man måste göra det som känns i hjärtat nu. Och yes. det är att göra olika spel på... You can still not understand something as it is in Swedish, but yeah, let's look if we can find something interesting and uh, uh, scary or whatever we can find on the AM band. Thing really but uh, yeah that was this little video about my maximal portable TV FM AM two band radio with the AC battery and yeah see you again soon <laughs>